Today by Yao, I'm here to give an example from chapter 7, the refrigeration cycle. A Carnot refrigeration cycle is executed in a closed system in the saturated liquid vapor mixture region using 1 kg of refrigerant 134A as the working fluid. The maximum and the minimum temperatures in the cycle are 20 degrees Celsius and negative 10 degrees Celsius, respectively. It is known that the refrigerant is saturated liquid at the end of the heat rejection process, and the network input to the cycle is 20 kJ. Determine the fraction of the mass of the refrigerant that vaporizes during the heat addition process, and the pressure at the end of the heat rejection process. So, our solution. So, to find the COP, we have this formula. So, refrigeration COP is equal to 1 over TH minus TL minus 1. So, substitute. So, COP is equal to 1 over, since it is Celsius, so we need this to convert into Kelvin. So, 20 plus 273 Kelvin over negative 10 plus 273 Kelvin minus 1. So, our COP is equal to 8.77. So, next. So, so, to find the QL, so QL is equal to COP times network input. So, QL is equal to 8.77 times 20 kilojoules. So, simplify. Our QL is equal to 175.4 kilojoules. So, the enthalpy of vibrations of R134A at negative 10 degrees Celsius is, is HF, HFG is equal to 205.96 kilojoules per kilogram at table A12. Table A12 in thermodynamics. So, so to find the QL or the mass, so QL is equal to mass times HFG at at TL is equal to negative 10 degrees Celsius. So, so mass is equal to 175.4 kilojoules, which is the QL, all over 205.96 kilojoules per kilogram, which is the HFG at negative 10 degrees Celsius. So, simplify. Our mass is equal to 0 0.852 kilojoules. Next. Therefore, the fraction of mass that vaporized during heat addition process is... So, our mass, so 0 0.852 kg divided by 1 kg is equal to 0 0.852 or 85.2%, which is, this is the heat addition. Next. So, to find the heat rejection, so P4 is equal to P sat at 20 degrees Celsius. So, equals to 572.07 kilopascal. We find this in table A11 in thermodynamics. So, 572.07 kilopascal, which is the pressure at the end of heat rejection process. Thank you for watching.